In this video, I'm going to be introducing arithmetic sequences. So here is an example of an arithmetic sequence. As you can see, and you should be able to easily spot, that this is a sequence that is going up in twos. Okay, So every time I'm moving along one place, I'm adding on two. And that is what defines an arithmetic sequence. Each term, uh, you just need to add or subtract a number from it to get to the next one. And that is a consistent number. So, for example, here, every time I'm adding on two. So, in general, if I had a starting number, okay, let's say A, and then... I added on a certain number, d, each time, then my sequence would look like this. a, a plus d, a plus 2d, a plus 3d, a plus 4d, etc. Okay? And that would be my sequence, with a starting term and a common difference. So we're going to be using a to represent the first term, and d to mean the common difference. Now, if this is the first term, that's the second term, that's the third term, fourth, fifth, and so on, then what I could say is that the nth term, un, so this represents the nth term, well, all of these terms in the sequence have a in it, and they also all have a d in it. But in each case, the number in front of the d is one less than the position. So, n minus 1, d, would fit. So, if I have n is 5, for example, for the fifth term, I would have a plus 4d, which I do there. Okay, when n is 5. So, you can use this as the nth term of an arithmetic sequence. And this is a formula that we're given. So, if I wanted to look back at this sequence and think, right, well, what is the nth term of that sequence? If I identify that a is 3, the first term is 3, and the common difference is 2, then the nth term is 3 plus n minus 1 d. And that is the nth term. Okay? So, when you were used to writing down the nth term, you probably wrote it down differently when you were doing GCSE rather than when you're doing it here. You can multiply this out, 3 plus 2n minus 2, then simplify to get 2n plus 1. And you may well be able to go from the, that sequence to 2n plus 1 quicker. But this, in general, is how we can define an arithmetic sequence. This is its nth term.